how to install the Sounds of Science Hertz wall mount on the back side of the Hertz sound absorber. The wall mount as a whole consists of these parts as you see before you. So this one goes on the back side of the absorber, this one goes on the wall, and these two goes on the bottom of the absorber, and these are the screws that we will use. So the part with the many holes, you will put that directly under the line that is drawn 10 centimeters from the edge. This line is drawn when you get the absorber. So you pl place it roughly in the middle, facing downwards, with this uh, tooth facing downwards, and then you just screw in the screws through the sound absorbing material, like this. Now, you don't have to be overly careful when you put this on when it comes to uh, placing it exactly in the middle because as you see this part goes on the wall and it slides back and forth and you can slide it quite a long while before it falls off so you need not be super exact when you put it on. So this one goes on the wall. The only thing left now are the two wall distances and they go in the bottom part of the absorber and this is in order to hold the absorber out from the wall. So let's put them on as well using the same type of screws. So we'll place one roughly here and again no need to be exact. And we'll place one here. And now we have done everything we need when it comes to the part that goes on the back side of the absorber. Now let's say you suddenly, when you're done, you find that the absorber is hanging too far up or too far down. Well, do not worry, you do not need to move the part that is on the wall, you just move the part that is on the absorber. So if you like the absorber to actually hang higher, then you just move it down. If you like the absorber to hang slightly lower, then you move this part up. Very, very easy and flexible, the whole thing. Thank you.